And here's a story a lot of you are clicking on to on THV11.com. A new poll shows a majority of Arkansas voters feel like recreational marijuana should be legal in the state. The poll from Talk Business and Politics and Hendricks College surveyed close to a thousand Arkansas voters. Here is exactly what they asked. What do you think should be the legal status of marijuana in Arkansas? A majority of respondents, 54% said it should be legal for adults. 32% said it should only be allowed for medical use. 11% said it should be illegal. With the legality of marijuana looking like more of a possibility this year, we decided to find out what this could mean for our local growers. And THV 11's Ashley Godwin asked, plus she shows us how it could get onto the ballot. It's been a lot of work, um, but the, the really cool thing is that we grow a product, a medicine that really, really helps people. River Valley Relief is a Fort Smith cultivator, growing and processing marijuana for Arkansas dispensaries. With this new poll showing more people wanting to legalize marijuana, growers are hoping and preparing for this budding industry to bloom. If you look at other states that went from medical to adult use, uh, yes, sometimes you see a two to three times increase in, in the amount of product being sold. We're hoping that by next week we'll be able to, everybody will be able to get out and start gathering signatures. There are five petitions that have been filed with the Secretary of State's office to legalize marijuana, one of those being the Arkansas Marijuana Amendment for 2022. We're reforming the medical and then just, oh, while we're at it, we're going to throw recreational in with it. The amendment would expand health conditions for medical marijuana license consideration and taxation of medical marijuana and limit it for recreational use, require dispensaries to sell both medical and recreational products, and expunge criminal records for those possessing 16 ounces of marijuana or less or six plants or less. That is my primary goal, to make sure that that the, the medical program survives and thrives and that our patients are able to afford their medicine and have access to the medicine. So now that a petition is filed, it must receive more than 89,000 signatures from Arkansans. It will then go to the Election Commission where they will either approve or deny if it gets on the ballot. In Little Rock, Ashley Godwin, THV 11 News. When you have questions, 11 listens. Text us at the number here on your screen, 501-376-1111, and let us know what you're wondering about when it comes to marijuana legalization. It's a complicated process, and as that poll shows, opinions are very divided on it here in Arkansas. We're here to help by finding the facts on how it all works, so let us know what you're unsure about by texting 501-376-1111. And you could see your question answered right here on THV 11 News.